exclamation, everybody, and welcome to Hotshot Racing. It is by Sumo Digital and Lucky Mountain Games and published by Curve Digital. It is currently 20 bucks US as I as I move over slightly so you can see that. Um on Steam. And it's fully released. And my damn phone is damn Go, go away. Freaking, freaking robocalls, man. Freaking robocalls. It doesn't matter how many things I how many things I block. They still keep on popping up. Okay. Um, anywho. Uh, so as you can see, it's kind of a old school-ish uh, view. Uh, arcade racing. Uh, lots of drifting and things. As you can see, it's going into a nice little attract mode. I like that. It's got kind of that arcade feel. I'm going to use my controller. I've played a little bit of this off camera and I was having, I was struggling. I was struggling quite a bit. Um, but I think it's important to to see see what's here. Because I think it's a, a, a decent game. It's just a very frustratingly coded game. <laughs> I think uh, is my, is my, uh, my hot take on that. But in any event, let's get the let's get a better view for you guys. And I'm gonna time box this. So we're gonna go and say 30 minutes on the clock. Starting now. There we go. Alright, um let's do Grand Prix. One player. Uh I'm gonna do normal because it's pretty rough. So, yeah, we're going to do that one and do normal. And uh, we'll, I guess we'll pick uh, pick Aston. Do you know my father? Oh, great. I would pick the douche. <laughs> I should just call him the douche. Bulldog. Bandit. Avenger. Shadow. Um, let's take the bulldog since it's balanced, and we'll see what happens on that. Automatic transmission. Balanced to perfection. Okay, <laughs> balanced to perfection. Four laps, it looks like. And it's got timer. Oh, oh, okay, that's a thing. I forgot when you break, you drift. So it's a lot like um, there was an outrun game. I should play this on stream at some point if I can get it, if I can find it again. But I had there was an outrun game on the old Xbox indie games thing. Um, service, and I, I forget exactly what it was called, but it was it was basically outrun, but everything was adrift, pretty much like this, uh, which is kind of interesting. So, here's the thing about this game, and you know I've played a lot of racing games, and my always my biggest complaint with racing games is the um, is the rubber banding. Rubber banding in this game is pretty damn terrible. Like, things rubber band way too much. Like, you go from first to, to fifth, even if you haven't done any anything wrong. Like, I mean, obviously I'm bouncing off of walls and stuff, but even without bouncing off walls, like, see, see right there? Like, you, it's, they're const, the AI is constantly up your ass. And, to some, that's considered a a challenge. To me, that's just uh, that's laziness. That's that's we couldn't we couldn't code our AI well, so we made them up just drive up your ass constantly because we couldn't make them actually drive properly without it. Um, that's the one thing that really rubs me wrong about this 
particular game. Like, I like me some arcade racing and stuff, but I also, I don't like the um, hardcore rubber banding like, like this game does. So. So just understand that when you're going in, because I'm not the only one who feels that way about <laughs> about rubber banding in, in racing games. Be like that guy. I was I was boosted, and he's and they. You know what I mean? This is what this is why. This is the one thing I don't like about that is like I was fully boosted. I was going full speed, and these guys just right at the last minute all fly by you. And I went from you know what should have been a third place finish to fifth. Right, and that's that feels like it's it, it honestly feels like it's broken. Like they they went like their code is not actually working properly. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that's how how ridiculous that how ridiculous it is. Again, they're right up my ass. Like that's that's the most annoying thing of the game. You see how I blew by them? Not gonna matter. They'll just blow right by me. Yeah, see right there. Like in any other in any other racing game, I would have like a commanding lead right now. And in this one, they decided that's not something they want, which is weird. Because you know, I get you know, I get being difficult and all, but at least be fair and be difficult. First place finally. Fifteen thousand. Now let's continue. Music's good. Um and I like the I mean I I don't the old school graphics are kinda nice too. I, I don't have any problem with old school old schoolness and old school gra graphics and stuff like that. I really like them. The only time I've ever and I've said this uh in a previous thing, the only time I've ever hated on the graphics of a game is when you can't tell what the hell is going on. Oh man, this is okay. We, we gotta we gotta retry that. I have to restart the entire. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Come on, because of a, a spin out, I gotta restart the entire freaking thing. And it was a weird spin out too. It wasn't like it was like the physics went wrong. Again, it's just like you can't that one turn is just weird like your car just won't turn see that's the other problem with 
with rubber banding is that it works both ways, right? It makes it feel like the game is, is being patronizing, right? Because I blew by all those guys instead of just being like, hey, I, I gained like one thing. I went from last to first, and that's that's the other problem with the whole we're going to make everything rubber band to the player. You know what I mean, like, they just let me, let me lead that lap, even though it should have been anything but. It's really not about how well you've raced, it's whether or not you've got enough nitro left to blast ahead of everybody at the very last minute. And unfortunately that's what bad rubber banding does. You know what I mean? Like that was the ugliest race you'd ever seen in your life. But because I saved some nitro before the end, you suddenly win and that's you know, it's not great. Granted, I am playing on easy or normal or whatever it is. I think I'm playing on normal. Whatever. But I was playing just for, for kicks. I was playing on a harder difficulty off, off camera. And it's not any better. <laughs> it's not any different. It's about the same thing. I couldn't tell you what the difficulty actually changed, honestly. Also, your driver doesn't shut the hell up either. Constantly making stupid comments. Physics. Who knows how they work? <laughs> Not like it's not like there's been hundreds of car racing games done in the past. Let's just redo the physics every time. Nope. All right. Oh, I'm getting achievement span. That's that's lovely. <laughs> that's that's what I want in my game. Achievement span. Um. Okay. Uh. Yep. Let's continue. Did I. Oh, I ended up on first. Oh, interesting. It turns out there are some things that money can't buy. Like the feeling of having earned something you've really, really labored for. That's something I'll cherish and remember forever. Because some things never change. Okay. <laughs> it's weird. Some things never change, like winning. Um, all right, let's take a look at some more of the some time boxing. This let's keep it on normal and look at some of the some of these other tracks. 
Let's pick someone other than Aston, eh? We'll pick Alexa. Oh, that, now that was a funny joke. Alexa this, Alexa that. Get someone else to play your music. I like that. That was that was good. That was a good one. Um, let's go for acceleration. Thunder. In the thunder. Check out the acceleration on this bad boy. Do 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 do. Pro circuits in the boneyard. Some code to stop them from hitting me in the back. Be great. Yep. Robin is racing. must have a lovely ass because they keep freaking hitting it. Look at that. I was boosting and he was still keeping right up with me. Shameful. Shameful. Continue. Okay. It's two or four. Drift yet here. Entire lap didn't have the drift. is though because I'm not drifting I'm not building up any nitro it doesn't look like oh that that was just BS here come on now
freaking hit me in the back and spun me around. Just enough to get nitro here. There we go. And that was that. <laughs> and drifted all into the last lap just to get just to get enough to get enough one bottle of nitro down the bottom and then boom. Okay. Yeah, Ocean World. Not to be confused with Water World, where everyone's drinking their own pee. Or at least Kevin Costner is, anyway. Total focus mode. Go, go, go. Tired of all the bumping and grinding. There it is. Okay. So there's one more race, I think, in this GP, right? Yep. Royal Railway. This feels old. Oh man. Music is actually really good. I like the, the timed sound effects too, with the chimps and stuff. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Like this is the kind of music I could I could listen to just during the day when I'm working. Um, also the soundtrack for the name. It, there was another racing game that I like a lot too that I've I've played a few times on stream. Can't think of the name of it now. It feels like it actually increases the tempo when you are on the final lap, which is, if that's the case, that's a, a nice... A nice, uh, oh, coming out loud. A nice feature. skin unlocked and all that stuff just for all these random things they have you do cool yo first place he could have seen me then standing in front of the cheering crowds but he wasn't there it was my dream not his and when it ended I went back to the garage where it all began I hoped that he'd be proud of me and you know what he was. <laughs> it's like an actual story playing out, which is hilarious. Um, I wonder if you get a different one for like the hard and expert modes too. Racing Elite, Dino Dash, Alpine Town, Heated Highway, and Casino Run. We've got four minutes left. We can get somewhere with this. Let's see if we can get at least Dino Dash in. We take uh, Kiko. Driving is art, like everything else. Light speed, Starfire, Super F ninety. Let's do that. The speed. One focus. Speed. Oh, it's basically like a Jurassic Park uh, uh, map. That's hilarious. Up there. Victor. 
Whitaker, you need to get out of my way. T-Rex roar there at the end. Alright, don't need to do any more drifts because we got our full up on nitrous. Bam! Mm, we're at 40 seconds. Uh, what's it, like two minutes for each one? Yeah, well, we're gonna have to stop there then. In time, time boxing things. Cool. We got. We at least got to see the dino, the dino. Uh, uh, what was it? Dino Dash, Heated Highway, Casino Run. <laughs> Casino Run seems like another. Like some of these actually seem like they would be um, Mario Kart, <laughs> Mario Kart like uh, courses, which is kind of cool. It's really cool. Like the the courses are are interesting and cool. Um, you know, it's really really the only problem. I have with the game is is the is the rubber banding. It's it's a little too a little too crazy. Crazy pants. Uh there's a race shop here. Vehicles. I guess we can customize our vehicles and stuff. Different skins. Huh. Kinda cool. Thousand bucks. So the money you, you money you win is really just for different cosmetics. Just fine. See what a few tweaks can do. That's cool. That's cool. All right, that shows you what the what you use the in-game money that you that you buy that you uh, you win. And I guess he's got what different racing suits. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> We'll give her we'll give her the Wolverine suit. Get the old Wolverine treatment. <laughs> the old X-Men Wolverine treatment. The the animated series Wolverine treatment. Um but that my friends has been Hotshot Racing. Uh let me get the let me get the thing up here. My overlays, so many buttons I gotta press anymore. I get a bit one of those bigger stream decks. Um, yes, this has been Hotshot Racing. It is by Sumo Digital and Lucky Mountain Games and published by Curve Digital. It is currently fully released down on Steam for 20 bucks US. Uh, for those watching the VOD, as always, I will leave links down in the description so you can do your own due diligence. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you next time.